Hi, this is ESPN.com NFL Nation Redskins reporter John Kine with the hot topics in Washington this week. General Manager Bruce Allen said on Tuesday that one consideration when looking at the draft is how the roster shapes up not only in 2015, but 2016 as well. With that criteria, let's take a look at three positions that could be impacted when the draft begins Thursday. And actually, for the Redskins, it starts Friday, of course. Anyways, the offensive line. The Redskins currently have six players who will enter their free agent year after the 2015 season, including left tackle Trent Williams. They only have two players under contract currently in 2016, two current starters, excuse me, Sean Laval and Corey Lichtensteiner. Clearly something could be done there, especially at right tackle. I think we all know that. Then you look at outside linebacker, Ryan Kerrigan, Brian Arakpo, both signed for this year. Only Kerrigan is signed for 2015 and neither for 2016. That's also why the Redskins have visited with a number of pass rushing types who could be available in the second round. That's also a sweet spot for that position. So, And if the Redskins decide they don't want to pay big money to both Kerrigan and Brian Arakpo, that's an area they could also look at, and I think it's why they are looking heavily there. Then you look at safety. Only two safeties are under contract for 2015, Philip Thomas and Bakari Ramble. The Redskins have some veterans to work with, Ryan Clark and Brandon Merriweather, and now with Tenard Jackson back, but you have to look at that as a question mark. The question, though, is... Is this safety class good enough and deep enough for them to find a guy worth keep putting on the roster in 2015 and beyond?